All right. We're here with Zulu. I've already drawn Zulu's new card, which is a long-range any-facing phase, any facing phaser. Say that three times real fast. Now, he has a lot of crap he can't use, but he can kill that cloaked uh, Klingon, cloaking Klingon. Uh, again, say that multiple times. So, uh, I think he's going to take a shot at doing that. Now, do we have any mid-range front? No, we don't over here. We do have a security team, so uh, I think we'll trade for that, actually. We'll give a mid-range side to Kirk for his security team. All right, so let's take some shots. Uh, we got a long-range side and a long-range side. That will kill that Klingon right there. And we have a uh, medium range front. Maybe we can get rid of some of these cards. That'll hit Kang for a bit. Uh, we also have a long range any facing. So that will hit. So do I hit Kang again? Or do I hit this other cruiser over here? Let's hit Kang again. Okay. Uh, that's really all Sulu can do. He doesn't have anybody on the sides. And he can't maneuver. So that's it for him. We'll check mission status. One more round and we can get a new mission. Maybe try to win this thing. Uh, threats move and fire. So Kang's going to move up here. Eat a card. This guy's going to move there. Eat a card. <laughs> Some photon torpedoes we lost. Uh, and all that's left is this guy here who's going to uncloak. So he's going to go counterclockwise. And then he's going to board. So when he's boarding, he's going to do one damage. However, security team. Security team reduces damage from boarders by one. So he dies, and we don't take any damage. <clears throat> that's it. And we draw two new threats. Because that's what you do. We have a Klingon battlecruiser and a Romulan battlecruiser. And where do they go? We have one at one. Very busy sec uh, sector of space. And the Romulans are also at one. This is ugly. What we need right now is a comet to hit one. Because it would only it would do two cards of damage to us, but it would murder all of these guys here. All right, let's draw up for Mr. Kirk. I mean, Captain Kirk. He didn't go to Starfleet to be called Mr. All right, we got a couple of cards we can use here. Um, but nothing, literally nothing that targets the front. See that? So Triox Compound. I'm going to draw three new Enterprise cards. I'm going to trade in this short-range phasers for it. So three new cards. We get multi-range rear. It's great. Dilithium. And direct hit. So if I could hit something, I would destroy it. Unfortunately, I can't hit anything. But let's give our dudes a break. No sensor contacts. So we won't draw any new threats. Oof. Um, there is literally nothing else I can do. So we'll hang on to the rest of this. But, good news everyone. We checked mission status and we failed to search and rescue that ship. Uh, there's no failure uh, component, so... Oh well. Sorry, ship. We failed to find you. Maybe you should have brought some guns and you could have dealt with all these Klingons on your own and these Romulans. All right. So that's done. Threats move. Kang's going to board. He's going to eat a card. And then this guy's going to move up. He's going to eat a card. And these guys are both going to move up and eat cards. So that's three cards. Gone. And there's some dilithium. And phasers and nurse chapels. So we're losing some really good cards here, guys. All right. That's it. Let's draw some more threats to come out of the one. Uh, we have Temporal Distortion and Core. Core heals all Klingons. 
which is fine because we didn't manage to damage any. But first, let's do this temporal distortion. We can move the mission timer, which there is none because the mission's gone. So that didn't have any effect. And where does Kor go? Kor goes to six. So he was, he he flew a little wide, out of formation from the other guys. But he's getting there. He found the Enterprise. He'll be here. Did we kill him once already? All right. So that's it for drawing two new threats. Okay, Sulu, you got this, buddy. Let's see what you got. You got to draw five cards. We got Tritanium, which is good. Short range rear phasers, useless. Multi range front, that's nice. We got medium range front, that's also nice. And a multi range front photon torpedo. Alright, so we can do some damage this round. So with the Tritanium, I want to heal that one damaged hull. I should probably save it, but if we lose that. We're that much closer to dead, and that's core over there. So my idea now is uh, let's hit core with these two cards here. Multi-range front and multi-range front photon torpedo. That does three damage and kills core. So that way he doesn't do damage to our front. We've just got to survive until we figure out what the next mission is. Uh, then we have medium-range front phasers. So we're going to do some damage to uh, this Romulan here. And that's all we can do. Okay. I forgot to get a new mission. The Trouble with Tribbles. Mission timer starts at 6. Now this should have happened before I played all those cards. So, uh, we may not trade. We must maneuver the Enterprise so that a Klingon ship is in short range and commit two command, one science, one engineering, and one medical to beam the Tribbles to the Klingon ship. If we do that, all uncloaked Klingon ships on the board take one damage. So, whatever. Minus, minor little bonus, but it's Tribbles, and we'll be one closer to winning. So we're already in short range of a Klingon, but, uh... We don't have a lot in the way of cards that we can donate, so let's see what happens here. Check mission status, drop it to five. Threats move and fire. I think we already did that. And so now we draw threats. Sorry for the scatterbrained nature of this game, folks. It's, uh, it can be a little bit much. Especially when you're losing as bad as I am right now. Uh, we got a Klingon Bird of Prey going to two. And we've got Koloth to the one, which is, again, the worst place ever. Uh, when Koloth comes out, all Klingon ships move one sector closer to the Enterprise. So he's going to move one. Uh, Romulan's gonna stay there, the Klingon, this Klingon's gonna move one, this Romulan's gonna stay, and he's gonna move one. <sighs> not pretty, not pretty at all, especially since Kirk can't draw any cards, and he has no front-facing fa uh, front phasers. So Kirk's turn is basically gonna be wasted. <clears throat> Alright, speaking of which, let's go over to Kirk Kirk's turn. Kirk does nothing. There's nothing to do. There's literally nothing he can do. He could even trade with Sulu and still have nothing to do. So he's just going to sit there on his hands. Uh, he's going to move down to four. With that, threats move and fire. So this guy's going to do two damage and eat two cards. Boom. This guy's going to do three damage and eat three cards. Boom, boom, boom. One of them was a dilithium. Um, he's going to move up and shoot. One more card, and then one more card for the Romulan. When he moves up and shoots, there's a Tritanium we lost. And then this Klingon is going to move up and cloak. Alright. 
This game really can snowball on you once you start to lose. Especially you start losing cards and you lose all your dilithium cards. Um, and if you lose all your symbol cards, you kind of are screwed. But let's see, we're, we're hanging on. We're hanging on for dear life right now. We're going to draw some new threats. Got a comet. So let's resolve that immediately. Go for one. Go for one. Six. So there's nobody there, and it's one of our last sections. So the comet comes in and blows up that, and we are one section from losing, folks. <laughs> one section from losing the Enterprise because of the comet. And here comes the Klingon battle cruiser to the two, right there. All right. Now we're back up to Sulu. He can get four cards. Maybe he can fix everything. He'll solve it all. Tritanium. And Dilithium. So he can fix a section. Good. Alright, so what else can we do? What do we need? Uh, Kirk has nothing that can help. And Sulu doesn't have much. So, uh... He's not going to trade. He will turn in these for a hull, hull healing. And that hull healing is going to be this one. Why not? Not this one, because it's just going to get destroyed right away again. Uh, he's got a short range front. He's got two of them. So with that, he will destroy this Romulan and kill or hit Can uh, Koloth for a point of damage. And that's all he can do. So um, this cloaked ship here is going to stay where it is, flip over, and board for two damage. So that's two more cards lost. And some more dilithium lost. Uh, and then uh, Koloth is going to board for two damage. And that's two cards lost. Time travel is gone. This guy's going to move forward and do one point of damage. That's another card lost. So that's it. Let's get two more threats. And I forgot to move the timer for the mission, so I'll do that in just a second. We have a supernova and an electromagnetic storm. I'll just move the timer to three. All right, roll a die. Rotate Enterprise that many facings clock, uh, clockwise. So it goes six clockwise, which means it ends up where it is. Roll a die. If a section has no shield, it takes one damage to that whole section. So two. It has no shield on two, so it takes one damage to that section, which kills a card. All right. We are back to Sulu, who gets to draw four cards. And that kills the deck, so I need to shuffle these. Be right back. All right, so uh, I've already drawn two cards for Sulu. I get two more, multi-phase front, uh, multi-range front phasers and tritanium. Okay, um, we will trade the short-range rear to Kirk for his dilithium, and then we will use that to heal another section, which will again be this one over here. So we're down to three. We can maneuver soon. All right, so let's do some work toward the mission. What do you say? I could put a command and a science. So that's all the science we need and half the command we need. And then... I have nothing else I can do. So that's it for Sulu. Uh, we count down the mission again. And we move and shoot. So this guy moves up, does one damage, destroys a card. And that's it for everyone that's coming. So it's Kirk time. Kirk is going to draw up. He's got six, so he doesn't draw up anything.
Uh, we don't reveal a new mission. Does he want to trade? No, he doesn't want to trade. So the first thing he's going to do is apply this command to the mission. So we've got two and one. We need a engine. We need an engineering and a medical now. Then he's going to play. Oh shoot! He needed to trade. Uh, he'll trade short range rear for uh, short range side. So let's pretend that happened earlier. Short range side. He's spending, and he's using direct hit along with it to destroy this gentleman right here. And that's all he can do. No one moves and shoots. Draw two new threats. Oh, and I gotta spin the uh, timer down. So we got a Romulan Bird of Prey and a Magnetic Storm. So let's see, Romulan Bird of Prey comes out in two, which is where he is already. And the Magnetic Storm, I roll and I turn one sector clockwise. So I'm turning further away from the starbase, which is awesome. Now, uh, that's it for Kirk. So it is Sulu Town. He draws four. Guns, 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 guns. Uh, yeah, we're gonna lose the trouble with troubles. Uh, we're gonna lose it anyway because there's no Klingons on the board. So, what happens now is, uh, Can we trade with anybody for anything? No. So, long range, any facing phasers. I'm going to shoot one at that guy. And that's it. That's it for Sulu. It seems to me that we've lost all of our cards that have the icons at the bottom, too. Um, but I did get kind of carried away trying to clear out all these uh, Klingons and stuff and I may have missed some opportunities to apply cards to the mission. But uh, that being said, that's it for Sulu. So this, Kling this Romulan's gonna move up in cloak, and that's it for the aliens. And now we're gonna draw some tokens. We have another Romulan Bird of Prey and a Tholian. So the Romulan is going to go to one, and the Tholian goes to one as well. Boom. Alright, I'm going to stop it right there. We're going to get a new mission and I'm, I feel compelled to defeat it, so I'm going to make it a new episode. Alright, back in a bit. Or also, thanks for watching <laughs> and uh, tune in.